Anastasia, aka A Hardry. What's up? How y'all doing? What's up? What's up? Welcome to the A Hardry Show. You guys rock. I'm telling you, get ready for this because we are on the 10 frustrations that piss me off. Okay, and I'm gonna help you deal with these frustrations because I know you yourself are dealing with some frustrations in your business because you're brand new or actually you've been dealing with the business for a long time and you don't really know where to go. Okay, so I'm gonna share with you my experience in this video with the number six frustration. Here we go, the number six frustration is offline or online marketing. Okay, let's deal with that. Okay. Okay, this is a frustration, and I know why, because I've dealt with this myself, all right? Before I became the Ace of Spades, I was just in, all right? I didn't have anybody in my business. I didn't know anybody. I had to make myself known. I dealt with flyers. I dealt with invitations. I dealt with giving out CDs. I even dealt with selling tickets, okay? And going to the library and trying to network my butt off in there and not finding nobody, okay? Or going to the local supermarket and not finding nobody. But when I was introduced to online marketing, oh, the whole world just opened for me. You see, I had to find a way to network myself online without having to worry about anybody judging me, okay? Because online, you can be anybody you want. Do you understand that? You can be anybody you want online, okay? But anybody can be anybody online. And I will tell you this, when I did it, I was myself. I was Andy. I was Anastasia Holdridge. I kept it real. I wasn't trying to be like anybody else. I was trying to be me. And that's exactly the way I kept it. Because my motto is keep it real, baby. And you got to keep it real. And what happened was when I was doing it, um, I realized that I had to first open up a Facebook account. And thanks to Facebook, my business is growing. Thanks to Facebook, my behind is actually getting to be known. My brand is actually coming out there. I mean, how do you explain this? How do you explain the A-Holdry VIP Skype party? How do you explain the A-Holdry show in general? Or the A-Holdry store, the store, the gear, the merchandise, the shoes? I mean, how do you explain all that? All that happens for a reason. Because I stayed positive. And I decided to do online marketing versus offline marketing. Now, Brandon, let me tell you. You can do both. But you got to create a balance. You got to have a balance in your business. If you're going to do online marketing, keep it consistent. Use some hours during your day after work, you know, and do it. If you're at the office and you're being monitored, okay, you know, the people that monitor you and they want to look in your cubicle and see what you're doing, then you wait till you get your butt home and then you start doing your business. But offline marketing is totally different. See, people think that you can do online marketing and offline marketing the same way. No, you can't. Because offline marketing, you have to use hard based material in your hands. You gotta have books, you gotta have papers, you gotta have something to give in person. A business card, a postcard, a letter, something that actually drives people to you. But online, you can use digital photos, digital format lettering, all that kind of stuff, videos, blogs, anything you want to drive traffic to your business. So don't think it's a frustration, don't make it a frustration. Go with the flow, because I had to deal with that. And now I'm thankful that I actually do online marketing. And I do a lot of online marketing actually more than I do offline marketing. But I have a balance. I do have a balance, because even though I do it more, it's because, you know, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I deal with that at home. And, you know, with my son and everything, I have to be on a computer most of the day. But then when I have to go offline, it's to do presentations. It's to go to people's homes and talk to them when they invite me to come over. And that's the way I do my offline marketing. I hope you learned from this video from the 10 frustrations that piss me off. These videos are actually keep coming and they're going to get even better. So you keep on listening and watching the A-Holdry Show and learn, 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 learn as much as you can from me, the Ace of Spades. I'll talk to you guys soon.